Thank you, President. It really gives me a great deal of pleasure today to introduce uh, Lieutenant General Retired Army, I might add, for all the rest of the services that are in here. And also uh, one of our latest uh, Manhattan City Commissioners, uh, Mike Dotson. Many of you uh, already know him, but Mike joins us as a transfer, and we did this a couple of weeks ago from Junction City. Mike joined the military in 1968 as a field artillery officer. Like many of us that uh, have served in the military, he's been around the world a couple of times. He served in Vietnam twice. He had a tour in the Gulf, three tours in Europe, and various other assignments here in the United States, including, as many of you know, a commanding general here at, at the 1st Infantry Division at Fort Riley. It uh, has certainly been a storied career throughout uh, his 30-plus uh, years. But as most of us, after we get through wearing a uniform, Mike we has worked in uh, uh, several different areas, one of them being Bechtel Construction, where uh, I guess about 10 years worth as far as Bechtel's concerned. But along with that, then we get into the civil service side of the house. Many of you all may not know that Mike is, and is still, that for that matter, uh, the chairman of the YMCA, as far as the board of directors is concerned, and now a uh, Manhattan City Commissioner. But I gotta highlight this because I didn't know the exact times here. Many of you also know Diane, his wife, they have three kids, two grandkids, and something I just learned, and that was this past July, and they've been married 50 years. Mike, welcome. We're glad to have you. Mike, welcome to the Manhattan Rotary Club. Here's your certificate of membership. Thank you very much. And uh, you, you have all your materials as a Rotarian from Junction City, so you don't, he doesn't get all the new, new Rotarian things. And here's a sponsor pin for Phil. All right. Thank you. you get a pin now if you sponsor a new member. So if you want one of those, I tell you. We even have, 